Good evening, everyone. Joe for jazbeeshobbyland.com with 2018 Topps Chrome Baseball 8-box. Pick your team number 9. This is Jumbo Edition. And slash prices, apparently. So there it is. On the 24th, here are the people taking advantage of the slashed pricing. I like the, <laughs> the image that Nick used for that. John with the Angels randomized him in the spot random. Stephen K, last spot mojo Mets. And Daniel got the Yankees randomized him. So congrats to those two. And big thanks to everybody who got into the action. Appreciate it. Eight box jumbo, five autographs per box. Hopefully we'll see some monsters in here. I think TD predicted a super fractor a little bit earlier. I certainly would not complain about that. That would be pretty cool. All right. Good luck, boys and girls. Here we go. Now, who's actually here for this break? Anyone uh, Anyone actually staying up this late on a Friday night? All right, so let's breeze through these. Rob, Robert's still up. He's looking for the Ichiro here. He's got the Mariners in this. We got Miguel Gomez to lead things off. Miguel Gomez for the Giants. That'll be for Big Boys 007. Got JP Crawford to 75. That's for the Giants. Oppo Joe Mojo, Big Boys 007. And we will top load, sleeve and top load those before they ship out. But just in the interest of time, kind of brief. Miguel Gomez. Another Miguel Gomez for Big Boys 007. Miguel Gomez PC. Out of 250. All right. Thanks, Stephen K. Appreciate that. We got Dylan Peters for the Miami Marlins for Thomas Hutchings. <laughs> Dilly Pickles? That's pretty good. That's pretty good. Cody Bellinger, purple. King D, what's going on? We got Tyler Wade. That'll be for the Yankees, Daniel Patero. We're watching the watching the old uh, El Trafico. This is. LAFC, yeah, we're watching MLS. LAFC versus the LA Galaxy. They're tied at one. And Scott Kingery. I don't think we've seen very many Scott Kingery autographs. DMAC with the Phillies. And King D just working hard. Scotty Jetpacks? All right, that's pretty good, too. And he's hoping, King D's hoping he gets a Springer or a Bregman autograph. All 
All right, nice start. Next box. How are my Dodgers doing tonight? Are they winning? Oh, this this gets me nervous when the Dodgers score 11 runs. Now we always feel like then that means <laughs> that means they're not going to score any runs against the Padres tomorrow. They're, they're using up all their bullets. Looks like ev most everything is a final. The Mariners beat the Diamondbacks six three, so the Dodgers can can gain a game, and the Rockies lost too seven to five or five to seven. Cardinals beat them seven to five. All right, so the Dodgers can gain gain a precious game in the NL West on those two teams. How about the Astros beating the Angels six to two? I got the Astros at minus. I actually picked the Astros today. There, there is actually some decent value there at minus one fifty eight. They're supposed to, they're, they were supposed to be like minus one eighty. I was like, minus 158? That's pretty good. That sounds good to me. I put I put the information into my supercomputer and it said it said take him and I and I did. There's Manny Margot out of 150 for the Padres, and we've got a redemption. It's Clint Frazier. Nice one for the Yankees. Daniel Patera getting the Yankees in a spot random. Nice. Now the Astros are up 6-2 in the top of the eighth. They jumped out to a 6 nothing lead and the Angels scratched a couple back, but I don't think I don't think it's going to I don't think the comeback is going to happen. Another redemption. Oh, is it 7-2 now? Oh, good. See? I'm okay. Upside down redemption. Can you guess going this way, folks? Can you guess going this way? A? <laughs> Who's, whose last name ends with an A? N? U? Acuna? C? Rookie autograph Ronald Acuna. Nice. That goes to Aaron Fisher and the Bravos. So Clint Frazier and Acuna in this box. Nice. You want to talk Mighty? We can talk Mighty Ducks. Another brave, Max Freed. Oh, a draw. Lame. Come on, Galaxy. How many Mighty Ducks did they end up making, Thomas? Jordan Luplow. We've seen him in action this year. Pirates, that goes to Shane and the Buckos. Pirates are currently tied with the Brew Crew in Milwaukee. They're tied with the Brewers 4-4, bottom of the 12th. There's Clint Frazier to 99. Oh, there you go. Another one for the Yankees. Did they only make three? I thought there was like a, I thought there was maybe like a direct to directed video, <laughs> fourth one. I don't remember the third one very well. The first two. There's Adrian Sanchez. Shane. All right, so nice box there.
Yeah, the first two were pretty good. I don't remember the third one as well. First one's a classic, though. I, there, I'll be honest with you. There was a there was a bit of speculation. I was just like, I was like, is I don't know, Mighty Ducks. That sounds a little lame, but I feel like what happened to those? <coughs> I mean, maybe they're still. Excuse me, losing my voice. Um, I mean, maybe these movies just don't exist anymore, or they're not as popular anymore. But I feel like there was a lot of great, like, family-friendly sports movies. Do kids just not want those movies anymore? It's just all about Air Buds now. But I feel like though, where are those kind of movies? Has it been just done already? The ragtag kids, a ragtag group of kids coming together. Coming together, setting their differences aside, coming together and 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 winning, reaching heights together. And I feel like where where are those movies? You know, you had we had like or like movies like we're like Rookie of the Year. Rookie of the Year was a great movie. What happened to that? Another redemption. A lot of redemptions here. Rookie autograph refractor parallel. R, E, <laughs> any guesses? Might be able to guess it now. Walker Bueller for the Dodgers. That'll be Fidel Cairo with my Dodgers. Nice. Future Dodgers ace right there. Jackson Stevens. All right, Angels in the outfield. That was a good one. Little Big League. Rookie of the Year. Mighty Ducks. I feel like that genre of movie is just doesn't doesn't seem to exist. Or maybe they do. Maybe maybe I maybe I just don't know. I'm not that age anymore, so there's Redugo to ninety nine. So maybe I'm not clued into that genre. Walker Bueller. Oh, he must he just didn't do the refractors, I see. So there's a live autograph of Walker Bueller, Fidel Cairo. That's what it looks like. Except the one you'll get when you redeem that will be shinier and out of four ninety nine, I think. Little Giants. Actually, I don't think I've seen that one. That's the that's the football one, though, right? But yeah, I don't think they make those. I don't think they make those movies, those kinds of movies anymore. Yeah, it's all Marvel movies. I'm kind of over it. Like I get it, Marvel, great. You know, a lot of lot of forced humor, a lot, lot too many characters. It's all confusing. It's like, how do these guys connect to each other? And they've got all spin-offs and movies. And uh, can't keep track. Can't keep track of any of them. There's Orlando Arcia, out of ninety-nine for the Brewers. That Alex Mejia goes to the X line and the Cardinals. Wow, nice Garrett Cooper gold, seven out of fifty. All right, movies like Sandlot. What happened to that? Yeah, movies like Remember the Titans. Where's where where are movies like that? It's a classic formula, right? It's just a ragtag group of kids, you know, setting their differences aside, you know, and coming together and overcoming whatever the adversity may be, whether it's a a large dog or whether it's you know battling discrimination in remember the remember the titans 
Sandlot had the dog. You know? Or misfit kids getting together. And mighty Ducks. If you're a kid that inherits ownership of a baseball team of the Twins, you do that. Yeah, they don't have that anymore. I saw Remember the Titans again recently, Josh, and um, it, I feel like it holds. I don't. I don't remember when it came out, but I feel like it it holds up over over time, over repeated viewings. Did Sandlot scare Thomas to not throw the ball over the fence? Right. Just be. There could be a beast back there. We got Chris Stratton, starter for the Giants for Big Boys 007. Another, another dirty, dirty giant. More Oppo Joe mode. Did they play today? Oh, they're leading. They're beating the uh, Rangers six three right now in the bottom of the seventh in San Francisco. Uh, I've never been to that stadium. I need to go to that. To go to that ballpark. Here, it's nice. There's Jacob Barnes for the Brew Crew. That'll be for Logan and the Brewers. There's Aaron Judge to 299 for the Yankees. Yeah, we need we need less less uh, Marvel movies. You know, more more of those sports movies. There's Paul Blackburn. Out of 499. Well, you you got the you got the spot randomizer TD. That that was half the battle. I blame the case. The case didn't cooperate. Is that green? It is seventy four and ninety nine. Nick and Del Monaco. And there is the one per case. It's Reese Hoskins. Rookie debut medallion, two out of 99. So we haven't seen an autographed one yet. That goes to DMAC and the Phillies. Nice. I think those are a cool addition to Topps Chrome. And there's Anthony Stantner. Stantander. Santa. Santa. Der. For the Orioles, Anthony going to the Orioles. Thomas Hutchings with that one. Yeah, I'd be surprised if we didn't do Gold Standard football on Tuesday. I would, I would be, I would be very surprised. And that Crown Royale only has the Celtics left. I'm sure that'll sell by twos by the time I go on air as well. Another redemption behind a nice, shimmery Bryce Harper. Ooh, gold refractor. Maybe it'll look like this. S? No, C. Oh, we know who that is. Oh, no, it's Clint Frazier. I thought it was going to be Chance Cisco. Bryce Harper, Shane, is out of 50. So another Clint Frazier, this time gold for Daniel Patera. Who got the Yankees in a spot randomizer being rewarded for giving that spot randomizer a shot. Thank you, Daniel. Tom is saying we need to have a horror sports movie. That would be cool. Some sort of horror. Wait, Teen Wolf wasn't scary enough for you?
He turns into a werewolf. That's terrifying. All right, next box. Yeah, gold standard's pretty nice. Brad, Brad, you, oh, you got the Eagles? Yeah, that'll break on Tuesday. I don't know if the Eagles have any big rookies this year, though, Brad, so it might be a little tougher to hit, but... Uh, Michael J. Fox kind of ruined that horror aspect. That was terrible. It was scary. That was a scary movie. Anytime someone turns into a werewolf, terrifying. Definitely not a comedy. It, it was definitely a horror movie. Friday the 13th, Teen Wolf, <laughs> Halloween. Right up there. We've got Reyes Moronta. Another giant autograph for Big Boys 007. The future Big Sexy. There's Jacob Faria to 150 and Sandy Alcantara for the Marlins. Thomas Hutchings with that one. Marlins edged out the Braves in Miami today. Uh, one to nothing. And I think they, they, they threw at Acuna again the other night. And, uh, did you guys see that? It's a bit of a Miami-Atlanta uh, rivalry kind of brewing there. Whoa! Shohei Otani! Nice! That goes to John R. That's our second one of the day. Different products, but 250 out of 250. Wow. Nice. That goes to John R., who got randomized the Angels in a spot random. There's my boy Kyle Farmer. Is John even watching live? He's going he's gonna to wake up tomorrow and watch this break. All right, TD's bummed. He had the he had the Angels in the spot random yesterday. Andrew Stevenson, or in the last break, Andrew Stevenson, Shane, with the Nationals. Well, TD, at least you didn't pay full price for the Angels. That's why those that's why those spot randoms could be beneficial for teams like that. There's DeGrom. And there you go. Another box in the books. And so we got that cornerstones Otani from the Chronicles today, and now the tops chrome Otani. That is strong. Nice one. Next box. Good luck, everyone.
CBK looking for some Mets. Where are the Mets at, he's saying? Well, you got Last Pot Mojo. That should increase your odds a little bit. All right, Thomas letting you know that they're in New York. Mets autos in here. Chris Flexen, maybe? Thomas Tomas Nito? Is Andres Jimenez in this set? There's Greg Allen for the tribe, TD, with the Indians. Just at Greg Allen. <laughs> Nothing creative there for Greg. Nikki Delmonico for the White Sox. Michael K with that one. What did the White Sox do? The White Sox beat the Tigers six to three. Josh Bell and Victor. I almost miss Victor Carantini's autograph every time. It's low. So you, can, you can almost breeze by it. Not this time, though, Bulldog fan. Will with the Cubs. All right, two autographs to go. Does he have autographs in this? Brandon Woodruff for the Brewers. Logan with the Brew Crew. Brewers and Pirates still tied in Milwaukee at four. Still tied, bottom of the 13th. That card is gold. That card is gold. 26 out of 50. We got Anthony Banda, hashtag Banda Love. 245 out of 299. That's Ray's edition. It'll be for Michael K. And Giovanni Gallegos for the Yankees. For Daniel Patera. Out of 499 Yankees beating the Orioles 7 to 5 in 10 innings in Baltimore. All right, two boxes to go, ladies and gentlemen. Coming up right after this will be a 12-box hobby version, random team version of Topps Chrome Baseball. And then after that, we'll give away break credit. And then after that, I'll go. I need. To, I'll need to go ice my hands after opening all these packs. Put, put the elbow in a in a vat of ice. Other game still in progress. Top of the ninth in in Anaheim. Astros still leading the Angels seven to three. Here in LA, Dodgers are up, still up eleven to one. Top of the ninth. 
against the Padres and the Giants in the top of the eighth in San Francisco, still leading the Rangers 6 2 4. Another Giovanni Gallegos. Uh, no, definitely not dry ice. Thomas. That would not be good. Yeah, I would like to retain the use of my hands. There's Jacob deGrom to 150. There's Garrett Cooper for the Marlins. That'll be for Thomas Hutchings and the Miami Marlins. Koopaloo. Paul Blackburn for the A's. That goes to Chi with the Oakland Athletics. Polly B. That's what he's going with, huh? Easy, Joe. Slow it down. Tiago Vieira. White Sox. Michael K. with that one. There we go. One, two, three, four. We have one more autograph in there. Here. Auto, 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 auto. Here. Auto, 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 auto. And it's Andrew Stevenson, Blue Wave autograph for Shane and the Nats. One twenty-two out of one fifty for the Nationals, and there you have it. That box in the books. Yeah, so what if I, if I did lose, if I did lose a hand, unfortunately, if I if I had to lose a hand, I would probably. I'd probably go to the same doctors that Luke Skywalker went to. And you know, and then and then get like a mechanical hand. Just like in Star Wars. Just get a mechanical hand. That technology's there somewhere. It was in a movie, it has to be true. That's where yeah, it has to be true. Good luck, everybody. Last box. We got Trevor Williams, Pirates, Shane with the Buckos. Dave, what's going on, man? You did. You got a. Actually, the Giants had had a handful of autographs. You had. Two Miguel Gomez autographs. You had a Reyes Moronta autograph. I think Chris Stratton, maybe. Hunter Wood. I don't think no relation to, to Alex Wood. Hunter Wood for the Rays. That'll be for Michael K.
And we've got Tyron Guerrero for the Marlins. Goes to Thomas. Yeah, he signs MLV, Dave, which is kind of weird. I was like that. There's no, there's no Miguel or Gomez in there at all. Actually, look up his full name, Thomas, or someone. You don't have to. Someone, someone, <laughs> look up his full. What if his, what if his full name is like Miguel Luis? Valdez Gomez or something like that. 40 out of 99. That goes to the Red Sox. Lee Cheeseman with that one. Got another Trevor Williams. Another one for Shane. Out of four, not easy, Nightbot. We're... we're, we're we're all full for the night. Wow. Another Shohei Otani. Woo. That's two. Two in one case. That's the kind. There he is. No, it doesn't have his full name there. Ten out of two ninety nine. Or it could be Miguel loves Venus. That could be a possibility too. And there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. What a finish! That was 2018 Topps Chrome Baseball 8-Box Pick Your Team Jumbo number 9 from jazbeeshobbyland.com. I think we have another case. Anyway, we'll break that next week. Thanks, everyone. We'll see you next time for the next baseball break. Bye-bye.